Arts and cultural groups across Florida could be taking a big hit this year. They're facing big funding cuts if Governor Rick Scott has his way. This all includes nine Polk County organizations. News Channel 8's Melissa Marino is at the Polk Museum of Art with the impact this could have. The bread and butter of a museum is this. They're exhibits. Take these away. That's what these organizations are afraid of. And the communities rely on the arts organization for hope and inspiration and joy and education. But the very places people rely on to get away are facing their own battle. You'll see programs cut. Um, you'll feel that impact in your community. That is, if Governor Rick Scott has his way. His 2017-2018 budget includes $6 million for cultural and museum grants. A big difference from the more than $18 million he allocated last year. At the Polk Museum of Art, these cuts would be devastating. Last year, they were awarded about $77,000, and at Governor Scott's proposal for the 2017-2018 year, the museum would stand to get about $25,000. So it's a big difference. The museum would feel it. The organization says this will put jobs and programs at risk. One-on-one -on -one family membership for... The CEO of Explorations 5 Children's Museum in Lakeland tells News Channel 8 this affects more than what meets the eye. We are working with families, low-income, hard-working families, uh, providing them with financial education and free tax prep assistance, trying to support the entire family. And Republican State Senator Kelly Stargell tells us the goal is to make sure government is spending money wisely. And is this something that government should be paying for? Is this something your tax dollars should be going to? Um, and then if so, to what level? And those are the budget decisions we have to make all the time. If this goes through, the organizations tell me the next step, they will need to find private donations to try and hopefully make up the difference. In Lakeland, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.